America is more divided than ever. Geographically, the political left clusters in cities, while the right tends to live in rural areas. And we don't consume the same media. America's so-called mainstream media are all left-leaning. Conservative media have a few large platforms, but they're easy to ignore if you're not already inclined to agree with them. And we don't learn from the same sources. In academia, students can't hear conservative viewpoints. Nationally, there are six liberal professors for every conservative one. At Harvard, the ratio is 51 to 1. If you don't know any Trump supporters, it's easy to convince yourself they're all stupid and half of them are deplorables. But perhaps your lack of interaction misleads you. If you're on the left, you might think that conservatives, who are more likely to be religious and less likely to accept global warming theory, don't understand science. But you'd be wrong. A study by Yale Law School professor Dan Kahn found Tea Partiers actually had the superior understanding of science. He confessed, I fully expected I'd be shown a modest negative correlation between identifying with the Tea Party and science comprehension. But then again, I don't know a single person who identifies with the Tea Party." Unquote. If you're on the left, you might think that conservatives who oppose government welfare programs don't care about the poor. Not so. A study by social scientist Arthur Brooks found that those who are less likely to support redistribution are more likely to be charitable themselves. If you're on the left, you might think that conservatives who regularly talk about far-left political violence are more likely to think of you as a threat to America. The exact opposite. A Georgetown University poll found it's Democrats who are more likely to believe, quote, that members of the opposing party are a threat to the United States and its people. In a study testing how well liberals and conservatives understand each other, social psychologist Jonathan Haidt found conservatives were consistently more accurate in predicting how liberals think about moral issues, while liberals, especially those self-describing as very liberal, were consistently less accurate in predicting how conservatives think about moral issues. Inside the left-wing bubble, people are protected from opinions and facts that run counter to the orthodoxy with which they're comfortable. Perhaps, if they'd learned more, they might find Trump supporters are everywhere, and not as evil or dumb as those with an agenda would want you to believe. I'm Dr. Stephen J. Allen. For more, read the full article on our website. And if you like this video, please help us share it and subscribe to our account. Thanks for watching.